Merry Christmas and happy holidays, everyone. This is Professor CC19 here together for the final three days of the Christmas countdown with Pittsburgh Pat. What a pleasant, what a pleasant adventure we're on here. We're gonna do three levels together. This is great. We're gonna see yes. each other's strategies. We're gonna share like our impressions of the game and and uh, maybe a couple of yeah. stories about Christmas too. So this will be fun. And just talk about Christmas and have a jolly old time as we yeah. culminate this countdown, the 23rd Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. All the magic yes. is about to go down. This is level 1068 on our quest to the end of Candy Crush Saga, where we have to clear all the jelly. And unfortunately, this is on a different device for me. And that means we don't have the snowflake blue candies. Um, and we That's also okay. have the old format for the jelly where it's only counting the squares and not the mm. layers. So mm. if you're playing this on a mobile device, this will say 102 jelly over here, but it will mm. the board should look exactly the same. Gotcha. So yeah, we have we have 25 moves. We need to collect keys from the dispensers on the left and the right. And I think the bombs are set at 20. We have candy bombs right down the middle. Yeah, it looks like 20 so, to me. Mm -hmm. And then we have some chocolate and some wrapped candies, which should help us out even more. Uh, I played this level once earlier today, and it went really well, kind of surprising to me with five colors on this board. So let's get it started. Really, any move just to draw these keys down, because they come There's down one. pretty quickly. We see we already have two. And also on the uh, new newest version of the game on my phone, you don't have the numbers for when you make a matches. Uh, when you make matches, it gives you here numbers for how many points you're scoring, but on the newest version, it doesn't have that at all. No. Mm -mm. All right. So as we go through this, we're going to talk about some of. Wow, that was that was really an amazing good. move there. Fantastic. Uh, now, of course, you I can make the, the, the wrapped candy right above the color bomb, but yeah. it's not a lot of reds, though, to take advantage of. Yeah, I would see that's the thing. This wrapped candy would be really nice, but there's not much red. I also see the two and two with the orange up above, but if I try and draw something down through the middle, it's just going to collapse it. So I think I'm going to go with stripe with the red instead. Yeah. Um, Actually, oh, I really don't know what to do. I'm going to see if I can maybe draw more red on the board. Um, yeah, red's such a rare board. color on most boards. It's, uh... Yeah, I noticed how like hardly any levels have yellow anymore in the game. Although for you particularly, you're uh, at the point in the game where there's not a set number of colors in a certain pattern. You can have dispensers dropping down um, any candy colors, which I think is a really mm. interesting idea for the game. Mm -hmm. yeah the, think, the upper levels have started to get really creative with um their blockers and their uh and and uh some levels some of the hard levels you really have to use boosters it's amazing yeah yes yeah, so there's a certain point where boosters are i don't want to say required in every level but let's just say it's a good thing that you can get entry boosters relatively easily for free yes <laughs> because you need a lot of them so yes. green is a much better color for this combo. And that is going to leave us just with this top area here. Gravity is kind of working against us. So towards the top is usually harder. Also, we have one over here too. Fantastic. So let's talk about Christmas for a bit because we're getting yeah. very close. and. Throughout this countdown, we've talked about like Christmas shopping, Christmas movies, uh, snow. Yes. How did that wrapped candy not touch the jelly there? Okay. I don't know. That was pretty uh, astounding, actually. Thanks, game. Thanks for your physics. But one thing I noticed is the anticipation getting closer to Christmas. I feel like I. I don't want to say I'm more stressed, but I'm more excited about the things that I know are going to happen. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I really am. Um, uh, you know, it's going to be uh, it's going to be fun. So what's We're, like the um, best? 
what's the best aspect of Christmas day for you? And I'll say for me too, like what is the thing you look forward to the most? Oh, it's definitely seeing the extended family, you know. I I mean, it's not going to be huge this year, but we're, we are going to get a few people together, kind of like, uh, you know, get our two pods together. But it's not the whole big extended family. It's just um, um, my uh, brother-in-law, my nephew and niece, that sort of, and, uh, and my brother. So actually, it's, it's, it'll be three, like, like nuclear families like meeting and having lunch and that's the biggest thing for me so yeah we don't have any really small kids that like the magic of santa claus is still a thing so (laughs) it's you know like the youngest is 11 so she's kind of you know she's (laughs) she's figured it out you know so yeah but um (laughs) you know it's it's but it's still fun so it's fun for me to give you know, yeah, exactly. Kid. Like, yeah. to, to be honest, I grew up in a family who was very honest. And like, even as a little kid, they, they, they told me that there was shocker, no actual Santa Claus, but um, just the spirit Spoiler. of it. I feel, I feel, <laughs> I feel like honestly more happy getting things for people than necessarily getting things. Although that makes me happy too. Yeah, that's and, true. I'm, I'm more like, I want to give my stuff away now. I, I, I've gotten to the point where I really kind of have everything I need. Well, definitely everything I need. And anything that I'm yeah. like buying now is just replacing something that's either worn out or it's like an upgrade, like electronics phone. That oh kind yeah, of stuff. absolutely. But things that kind of go obsolete within a, two, a year or two, but, but anything else, you know, I just, I just like, there's just stuff like every day now I'm trying to give like, you know, there's little libraries around, the neighborhood I mean, every day i try to give a book or uh something or you know something oh. like and then the, and the little food pantries i try to like give little um useful items in there as well yeah. not always not always food but like sometimes like i don't know little tools or um you know yeah. like a flashlight what are those libraries, things what like are those that libraries you know? called yeah. I thought there was like a special term for those. Like, like you leave a book, like they're not in like a building. But leave like, a book, take a book. I think they were, I think libraries. they're just called little all. libraries. Um, but I don't know for sure. I know there's like a brand name. There's a couple brand names out there, I think. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I would have definitely have to say that, uh, yeah, seeing family is probably the best for me too. It's very similar. I don't have a heck of a lot of family, but mm-hmm. uh, my family is very spread out. So it's good to see them all come together. So Christmas, I go over to see my parents and my sister-in-law and uh, her little niece and my great aunt and uncle. And we eat and watch um, our tradition movie for 30 years. I said, I didn't say for 30 years, but White Christmas, the classic. Irving oh, Berlin, yeah, that's a great movie. That tradition has been our family for that long. So, yeah. Wow. All right, so that is level 1068. All right, 1068 this, is done. This will be back. Well, we will be back tomorrow in time, December 24th, Christmas Eve. That will be on Pittsburgh Pat's channel. Thank you so much for watching today. I hope we have brightened your day. Subscribe to both of us, please. We really appreciate it. You will not want to miss out on all the content we have coming out year round. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Hope to see you again very soon. Bye. Yeah, everybody. See you tomorrow.